So here's the game plan. We're going to start by rendering out our architectural scene as an image sequence using D5 Render. Then, we'll bring those images into After Effects, stitch them together into an animation, and add some Dehancer effects for that extra wow factor. Let's kick things off with D5 Render. This powerful software is going to be our ticket to creating some seriously impressive animations. We'll set up our scene, dial in the lighting and materials, and then hit that Render button to generate our image sequence. You can download this scene from D5 Render's website. Check out the link in the description section. Create some movement for the tree asset by enabling the wind parameter under the environment tab. Next, you can render this clip by using the sequence option under the export section. While our images are rendering, let me introduce you to our sponsor for today's video, Dehancer. This incredible plugin for After Effects brings a whole new level of cinematic beauty to your videos. Enhance the mood and atmosphere of your architectural animations with just a few clicks. From film grain to color grading, it's got everything you need to make your visuals pop. It is an absolute game changer. And the best part? Dehancer is currently offering an exclusive discount. Just use the code SCL10 at checkout to get 10% off your purchase. All right, our render is done. Now let's hop into After Effects and bring these images to life. In After Effects, we'll import our images like so. Make sure that these options are ticked, click import, and then have a quick preview of your new clip. And now it's time for the secret sauce, Dehancer. Go ahead and add a new adjustment layer. Then go to the Effects and Presets panel, click on Film Emulation, and double-click on Dehancer. Play around with different film profiles, film grain, halation and bloom, and a little bit of vignette. There are plenty of film profiles to choose from. Make sure to enable each parameter to enable the effect. You can follow exactly the same parameters, or better yet, have fun exploring and tweaking all its settings. Halation. This is one of my favorite parameters to use in Dehancer. It creates a softer or dreamy look around the bright areas of the scene. These are usually the light source or highlights of the subject. While halation and bloom seems to be similar, bloom usually are glowing effects caused by reflections. Then, what I would like to do is add some chromatic aberration. And maybe even a little bit of motion blur for that extra cinematic touch.
And just like that, we've transformed our static images into a stunning architectural animation. With D5 Render, After Effects, and Dehancer, you have all the tools you need to create stunning 3D architectural animations. Thanks again to Dehancer for making this video possible. All links are in the description below for more information and do take advantage of that discount code. Remember to use the code SCL10 for 10% off your purchase upon checkout. Now for those who want to edit their stuff on the go, Dehancer is also available on the iOS platform. It's so easy and fun to use. You can edit both photos and videos inside the app. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more content like this. Until next time, keep creating and keep pushing those boundaries. If you want to learn more about architectural visualizations, click on the next video right here.